At this moment, we need answers from George Santos. He appears to be a complete and utter fraud. His whole life story made up. And he's going to have to answer that question. Did you perpetrate a fraud on the voters of the 3rd Congressional District in New York? Right now, George Santos appears to be in the witness protection program. No one can find him. He's hiding from legitimate questions that his constituents are asking about his education, about his so-called charity, about his work experience, about his criminal entanglement in Brazil, about every aspect, it appears, of his life. It's also apparent to me that George Santos has perpetrated a fraud in terms of his views on delivering for the people of Nassau County. He pretended to be a moderate on the campaign trail. We know that is not true. He's consistently played footsie with white supremacists, election deniers, and those who seek to overturn our democracy. And so we'll see what happens on January 3rd. It's an open question to me as to whether this is the type of individual that the incoming majority should welcome to Congress. That's a question for Kevin McCarthy at this point in time.